Audio modeling has really pushed physics modeling on so many levels with a lot of controls and it can be quite overwhelming to search for which one will suit our needs. So let's take a quick tour of what we can do with SWAM on our array touch. To start on the SWAM plugin, you have the quick and easy way and a more custom one. For the easy way, click on MIDI, presets, select the instrument presets. It's already set up some control, like expression on the aftertouch and the pitch bend range. Now we'll use the flute. We want to add some controls in addition to what we already have. Let's take faders. I'll change the color to fit a bit better the rest of the layout. Then I'll duplicate it, holding Alt and dragging it from the first one. Now I have to make sure that they are not on the same CC number, so they are independent from each other. Again, on SWAM we can save some time by selecting the instrument presets. But now we want to map our two new faders. Let's go back to MIDI, selecting the control we want to use, click on Learn and touching the relevant fader. We'll do the same for the second one. Okay, so that's one way to do it. And even if that's not the one I prefer, it can be quite useful for some controls. Another technique that we can use is a little trick. Let's try it on a trumpet. We start from the same fader, but this time we won't use it as a regular fader. In fact, we'll make its three parts the same color. And we'll deactivate the y-axis. Instead, we'll only use the pressure. After that, we can duplicate it by holding Alt and then again making sure that they are not on the same control number. So let's go back on our instruments. I'll do the same thing. Click on MIDI, Presets, Instrument. Then MIDI again, selecting the control I want, Learn, tap on the element and do the same for the second one. Now, those two squares control these parameters on pressure. Oh and make sure that the element you're using have the same pitch bend range that the SWAM instrument. As every SWAM instrument are monophonic, we don't even have to enable MPE, but we still can go to 48 of pitch bend range. What I just showed you was just a tiny part of what articulation and realism the SWAM instrument can do. And the thing is, I can't show you the best layout for a SWAM instrument or the best way to play. I will just show you a few. But remember that the Air Ride Touch is a fully customizable controller. So explore and try your different configuration. Find the one that fits your needs and where you have the most fun. Thank you very much for your attention.